the starting line. It's in the opening tip when we come back here to Norfolk, here on Comcast Sports Network. Here, here at Old Dominion, Jim Corrigan, Rob Wilkes, and John Richardson are Blaine's assistants. Nice move by Palmore underneath and scores. So the freshman turns it over on one possession, Brian, and makes it. So those points have come from the charity strike. A steal by the Blue Hens as they pick the pocket of Hill. Here's three, attacking and rejected by Richard. Baptiste picking up the foul, and now another turnover into the hands of Anderson, who will finish. They have been able to stay in this game with their defense, and I think that you'd rather be a team that's struggling to find baskets, as you see the penetration of basket by Palmer. Live with freshman possession by possession, and Palmore in his last three possessions has made things happen for ODU. Rejected on the inside by Batten. And Batten at the other end attacks and scores. The first free throw miss of the day by Delaware leads to a chance for Batten and had that rejected by three, who went up on his fellow number four. Sadler dishes off to Briz. Bako, their outstanding young freshman guard, out with a concussion. Is another reject. Dante Hill, second leading scorer on the Monarchs. Quiet today. They put the ball in his hand with five to shoot. Hill attacks and by Hagens, and here comes Jarvis three. So Old Dominion starts the way the second half the way they did in the first, turning the ball over. Back to Brinkley, a nice back and forth between Brinkley and Hagen's full year to get acclimated. He came right from North Carolina State and is really trying to understand a completely different offense. Delaware three of nine, which is actually better than what they usually average from Sadler. Attacks, block. This time Larson got the full block and he gets fouled as Baptiste wraps him up. We meant the following season in 2014, the Baltimore Arena, first Mariner Arena, will be the host. So it's going to be a little more of a neutral side, although Towson would like to make it a home court advantage there. Pretty finish on this afternoon. A lot of fun watching University of Delaware snap a six-game losing streak in this building. Four games overall as Monte Ross, led by Devon Sadler, gets the win on the road here in Norfolk, Virginia.